Welcome to Zen Basket. In this video, you will learn how to set up your store details with all the important information, from contact details to managing whether it's open or closed. You will also learn how to add a logo or fav icon for branding purposes. To make it happen, explore the settings menu and select store details. Here, you'll find some of the details you provided during the sign-up procedure. Your store name can be edited at any time. The fields that are disabled are the ones you cannot change here, but they can be edited on their respective pages. However, the details, such as email ID and contact number, cannot be edited here, but it can be done in my account. The industry type can also be changed anytime, just like the store name. The website subdomain shows up in the website's URL and can't be changed here, but can be changed in the domain configuration setting. To know more about domain configuration, check out the link in the description. The selected nation's currency unit will be displayed here. This field can't be edited anywhere. If you want to provide a person's name for your store, enter here. If you have a taxation ID for your store, then enter here. Here, you have the option to control the status of your store, whether it is open or closed. When the status is changed to closed, enter the reason and click Save. and this will be displayed on the storefront. One thing to note here is that while the store is closed, your customer can add the products to their cart but cannot place the order. You can upload your store's logo by clicking the Upload Image button and selecting Browse Files to choose an image from your system. The logo will be prominently displayed in all your email notifications and invoices. Next, upload a fab icon to your website This icon will be visible on the left side of the tab's title. Provide the fitting SEO keyword and description to optimize your store. The default address shown here is the one you provided during the sign-up procedure. Include your social media links in your store for customers to find you by pasting the URL here. That's it. Now you know how to customize your store details. To know more, visit our help article. Make sure you like, subscribe, and get notified so you don't miss out on any of our future videos. Let us know if you have any queries. Thanks for your support, 